Your books are fabulous. Uh, baby birds, an artist look into the nest. Look at this. This is this is so beautiful. It's um, my three and a half pound baby. My yeah, bouncing is, baby. Is that right? There. Yeah. <laughs> so you actually were able to find nests of all these species? Yeah, 17 species. Wow. Yeah. Wow. It's a 13 year project. Um, Rough, uh, I mean, wild turkey? That's just, uh, well, these are all actually songbirds. You just uh, looked at the four. Oh, okay, all right. Um, yeah, all songbirds. A lot of them came to me since I'm a licensed rehabber. Okay, so ah. like the chimney swifts and the hummingbirds, I actually hand raised so I could paint from them. Um, so yeah, uh, but the other ones, I was actually taking the baby out of the nest, bringing it into the studio for about 30 minutes, feeding it, keeping it warm, painting its picture, and then putting it back in the nest. Wow. Which I'm permitted to do, and yeah. which you should okay. want to try at home. Yeah. You know? yeah. uh, so you're permitted to do what? What kinds of wildlife? Just birds? Oh, I wildlife, have permits or? for birds and bats, um, oh, wow. songbirds and bats. Okay. I don't take raptors because I don't have the facilities yeah, right, right. or the interest in frozen mice and things like that. <laughs> well, I didn't know if you were like the squirrels and the no, uh, uh, no. People are forever calling me about fawns, squirrels, opossums, uh, yeah, right. but I, I, I yeah. stick to birds. Yeah. There are very few people doing songbirds. Uh, you know, rehab, uh, and so they are kind of the orphans. You know, there are a lot of people doing uh, raptors mm -hmm, mm -hmm. because you can basically put a frozen rat in a raptor cage and walk away. That's mm -hmm, your, you're mm -hmm. done for yeah, the day. Yeah. But baby songbird, you're feeding every half hour. You know, so not a lot of people want to sign up for that. You know, what was interesting is not too long ago, um, Tim Jasinski, who works at the Lake Erie Nature and Science Center, he's said, awesome. Yeah, he was. He's working with the woodcocks that are striking the buildings downtown. Oh. And he has a terrible time trying to get them to feed. Mm -hmm. And he sends out this Facebook post, and he's like, it's, it's this dirt with holes in it. And it's like, what is this? You know, he kind of questioned, tossed out to people. And, mm -hmm. and I'm like, I know what it is. Yeah. And people were ans ask, you know, answering, uh, uh, oh, earthworms. Uh -huh. and, uh, and I'm like, no, this is where I think he got the, the, the uh, woodcock to finally probe and feed those that he was rehabbing. You've got to bury their food. Yeah. I, so, I discovered that with a woodcock I had. It wouldn't eat out of a dish. There yeah. were the worms just lying there. As soon as I covered them with leaves and dirt, started wow. probing. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. So, so. you got to think like the bird. You oh, have yeah. to think yeah. like the bird. You can't, you can't think like a human. Right. Yeah. <laughs>